We are at StarCast 4, and I am here with Britt, sorry, Dr. Britt Baker, DMD. First thing I got to tell you, I got braces when I was younger. I had them for four years, but my teeth moved. Did you wear your retainers? I lost it. Well, that's why. You I lost my retainer. Oh, oh, you got to wear your retainers. <laughs> All right, so Britt, what we're going to do, I have two questions for you that have nothing to do with wrestling, okay. and I have two questions about wrestling. Okay, Gives your cool. fans a chance to see a different side of you. Okay. First question. Is there any odd food combinations that you like that not many people do? Yeah. I okay, I love cottage cheese with peanut butter and jelly in it. I thought you were going to say wheat thins. because we no. Cottage cheese and wheat thins. I love cottage cheese with peanut butter and jelly. That is certainly different. Yeah. Next question I have, you have a big match against B. Priestley. You guys haven't exactly been getting along the best. No, no, sir. If you had a plan walking into this match, she can get brutal. Yeah. So I want to know what your plan is going into this big match with B. Well, now I know, I know her. I know what she's going to do. I know what she's going to try to do. So now I'm ready for that. Now you know what to expect. Like, you know, I'm, I know I'm walking to the ring with someone who, who doesn't care about me or, or if I walk out on on my two legs or if I get taken out on a stretcher. She doesn't care. So I guess I'm kind of have that same mentality and, you know, I'm, I'm going to get her in the lockjaw and that's it. She's, like whatever happens, happens. That's it. Exactly. I love it. I love it. Next question I have for you. I asked this before. I asked this to Sean Spears, but I'm really interested. If you were on death row and you had one meal left, cooked by anyone from any restaurant, where would it be and why? Like, for example, mine would be, like, my grandmother's stuffed peppers. What would yours be? Oh, okay. My mom's pork and sauerkraut and mashed potatoes that we eat every New Year's Eve. That's, like, my favorite food ever. Mom's pork and sauerkraut? Yeah, pork and sauerkraut. I could eat, like, a bo- I'm so gross. I could eat a bowl of sauerkraut. I just love oh the taste. Oh, my God. Love it, yeah. That is weird. I, I can't do that. I hate sauerkraut. I love it. I love That's it. fantastic. Britt, last question I have for you. We're going into a here tomorrow. It's a big deal. How has life changed for you oh now that you're here, you're on these papers? Yes. Because you are, a lot of people, even including me, I see you as one of, if not the forefront of this women's division. Yes. How has that changed your life? Well, you're, you're definitely all eyes on you all the time. Like, and, you know, it's, every time I get on Twitter, I, I have all these notifications. Some are really nice and awesome. Some are brutal and mean and nasty. And it's just like, it, that's a whole new... I, I'm not used to people caring so much about what I do in the ring because I've never had this many eyes on me. But I, I love it. I love I love the pressure. I love the, the new attention because I'm part of this division. If I'm representing the women's division, you know, I, want, I want people to be attention. So um, it, it's definitely been a whirlwind, and I'm definitely I still tons to learn. I'm, I'm really learning as I go. Like, really grown into this event and all this, but uh, I've had a lot of fun, and I'm, I'm loving it. I gotta let you know I love the lockdown. Thank you. I think that's amazing. Thank you. Well, Brett, thank you for your time. Thank Best you. of luck tomorrow. Thank you very much. Bye, guys.